Ladies and gentlemen of the internet, welcome, welcome, welcome. So we're today with Dreamcatcher Scream Reaction. This one was recommended by Z Court. I hope I'm saying your name right. Uh, thank you for the recommendation, Z Court. Um, who basically said, in like one of my, one of the earlier videos of mine, he basically said that if I want to check out uh, another K-pop group, I should. He would recommend it. Dreamcatcher. It's a group underrated, and you're gonna be in love for their best songs. Ah, Scream. Baka, Odd Eye, and a few other songs. Uh, and I said, you know what, I'll start with the first one that you mentioned, and that's Scream. So we're going to start with Scream, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I'll have the link to the original video in the description down below, so you guys can check it out before you watch my reaction to it. Ooh, let me go back, sorry. Um, I'm just changing these settings to 4K. Um, and with that said, ladies and gentlemen, yeah, I would say let us hop right in. Let us hop right in and see what this one is all about, what this one has in store for us, how this one sounds, so on and so forth. This is Dreamcatcher's Scream. I like the title, Scream. It's very simple. Okay. This feels heavy. I just feel heavy. Oh, sorry. Uh, the instrumental in this one is just is crazy. It's so crazy. Like, like, Aye, that, that, the instrumental in this one is mad wild. All right. And the, the singing is very strong as well, which helps with the strong instrumental. Right, this is this is different. <laughs> this is different. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. My jolly goodness! 
This was not what I expected. I ain't gonna lie. I did not expect that, I This was, like, I've only listened to twice so far, right? And, and theirs is, like, very much, like, pop, as I said. Um, it, that, like, that, you know, K-pop. <laughs> this one feels more like K-rock. <laughs> but granted, I don't listen to rock either, so I wouldn't know if it's more like K-metal. But that's what it almost feels like. Like, this one, like, immediately when I saw the tree, I thought Yggdrasil. And that was the first thought that I had. Um, but actually, I had two faults in my mind. Like, when I saw this tree, I thought either Yggdrasil or the Garden of Eden. I don't know why, but those are, like, two faults that I had. And then, like, when they like, almost like the the war drums. That's really what it, that's what it really, really, really sounded like. The war drums, like the Viking war drums. When that just kicked in, I was like, okay, yeah, this definitely, uh, like, this definitely gives me a Vikings theme. Like, a uh, Icelandic, you know, Norse theme. And then later on, you see like a sword during the video. I'm like, okay, bro, this is, it, 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 come on, how am I, I, this is Vikings. This is clearly related. It's clearly linked. It's clearly, you know, thematically a, like, like a Viking song. Now, I could be completely wrong here, but that's the vibe that I got. This, this felt very hardcore. Like, this felt very, what did I expect? I, I guess I expected something a lot more slower because of the title Scream. So I felt like something a lot slower, something a lot more creepy. Um, you know, when I think when I think scream, I think most people naturally like don't assume like like scream like, ah, you know that that kind of scream. Uh, at least that's what not what I thought. I thought more like a ah, kind of scream. You know, like uh, like a scared slash uh, haunting vibe rather than a marching angry, not angry, but like a marching determined letting things go kind of scream so i guess that was my expectations i had completely different expectations to what we got and you know what i really like this song. i really like this song this one is like a that like oh you're feeling down in the morning you know you, you just had a lot you, know, you just slept for like two hours you know you, you had a late night and you just slept for two hours and now you need some energy there you go <laughs> there you go now again the, the person that recommended this one said you know oh you know on my first k-pop video he was like, oh, you should check them out. Again, I don't think this is K-pop. This, this felt more like K-rock or K-metal. You know, that's what this one felt like. Just like, I need to go back to metal on this channel. Like, like rock and metal. Because again, those are two genres that I'm not familiar with at all. Um, so that might be something that I'm going to have to look into in the future. Dreamcatcher, my first reaction of this, I very much like. I, I can't lie. I very much like, this was a very fun video, a very fun song. The song, the singing, I thought the voice, I thought their singing, I thought their singing was very strong because the, uh, you know, the instrumentation was very strong. So you needed a very strong singing voice. And I'm glad that we got that because otherwise it could have, like, the singing could have almost been drowned out by the instruments. And I didn't want that to be the case because the instruments were so good that I wanted it to be accompanied by, you know, very good singing as well. And which it was. So I'm very happy about that. Yeah. Um, again, I've got a list that the person sent me. There's a few more on that list, so we'll see whether we'll check those out in the future. But the, this one that I checked out, you know, this recommendation that was given to me, um, I very much liked. I, I can't lie, I very much liked. So thanks for the recommendation. And also, let me know if you have any more recommendations, ladies and gentlemen. You can always leave them in the comment section down below, and I'll get to them eventually. Eventually. Maybe like 50 years time, but eventually. With that said, though, I'll see all of you in the next one, everyone. Until then, have a nice day. Peace out, and as always.